So, I'm going to try this thing that Troy does. I almost call him Thoy. His name is Troy. He wraps lights around himself. And I don't know where to put these, but I want to be festive. So I shall do the same thing. How does he do this? I'm already annoyed. Okay, hi everybody, it's me, Maddie, and welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Maddie, and I post bookish-related content. I just realized that I don't have my necklace on, um, and it's bugging me, but I don't want to untangle myself from these lights, so I'm so sorry, please forgive me. But today, I am going to be doing my December TBR <laughs> in lights. I don't know where to put them. I'm so sorry. They bug me. I'm probably they're probably gonna bug me in post, but we're just gonna go with that. So yes, I'm going to do my December TBR. Now, this is the second time I filmed this because the first time I filmed it, I got this. I landed on a baby, but we're not surprised, are we? I have to add another book to my TBR. Oh my god, no! Five, six, seven, it's a seven! Ugh, okay, a stupid another book. That is five books for December! Five, six, seven. No! Oh my god, this game's hating me! No, 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 I landed on another baby! Uh, you heard a big bonus. Read a big book! Oh! a big book. Fingers crossed one more book. <laughs> no! No! It's a five! It's a five! Oh my god, no! What? Yeah, I got like eight rolls. Um... I'm cheating and re-rolling. I don't care what you say. I don't care if you're like, Wait, that's that's not fair. It is fair. It's my game. I'm not going to read eight books in December. That'd be completely pointless and just dumb to do. And that'd be a waste of the, the prompt cards anyway. So we're just going to roll with it. I am redoing the game. I hope you understand because... I'm not reading eight books in December, especially with all the videos I'm going to have to film for end of the year. So, go with it, okay? And I'm also going to be reading books for a specific video that I'm doing. It's going up next year. Um, so, again, go with me, okay? Alright, hi. <laughs> so, I've already edited this entire video. But I need to update you guys on uh, November's books. So, these are the books I had to read for November. And I have read all of them. So I read Hollow Pox, I've read The School for Good and Evil, and I decided to DNF the Hazelwood. Sorry, Mom. I just can't get into the Hazelwood. I just, I didn't get very far into it, so I probably should have given it a better try. But... It just didn't pull me in or anything, um, so, yeah, that's my update. Um, you know, I don't always read all the books. I might only read one from the TBR that I have that month, but I have a lot of fun filming these videos, and that's, all that, that's ultimately all that matters, but for November, I'd say it's a success, because I decided to do enough The Hazelwood, so November's a success. All right, let's get back into the actual December TBR. Troy, how do you do this? Because I'm annoyed. Okay, let's move on to November's, uh, wait, hold on. Let's move on to December's rolls. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Roll numero uno. Or I guess it'd be numero un. All right, we got a three. One, two, three. And that is our second three that we have, because I keep care take I keep track of the spins because if we get three of the same number, then we have to add another book to the TBR. So we got three. And I'm thinking of implementing a new rule. So the number we get on the die that tells us how many cards we have to go. So since we got a three, we have one, 
two, and then this would be the card. So it's you earned a big bonus, read a big book. All right, which basically means read a book over 500 pages. Okay, so for roll number one, we got the prompt of read a big book. And I originally said that this was for uh, reading a book over 500 pages, but I found out that I have another prompt in there that says read a book over 500 pages. So for this, we're just gonna say read a book that looks big, okay? And so for this, I am picking Ninth House by Lee Bardugo. This is a 450 page book. And yes, I am cheating this prompt a bit because I want to read this book. I don't know what it is, but like for the past like three or so months, I have been desperately wanting to read this book. And now that it's on my TBR, I'm probably not going to want to read it because me. Um, but I just, I really want to read this. After reading, Sarah J. Mass's adult fantasy. I'm kind of scared because that one sucked. But, and I've heard like iffy things about this. I've heard like it. some people like really don't like it, and some people like this is like their favorite book of 2019 when it came out. So I am kind of scared, but I'm really, really excited. I used to love Lee Bardugo, but I did not like uh, any of her other books. So I am scared to read this, but I'm also really, really excited. I just, I'm, I really want to read this book, and I really hope I like it. Um, I don't know much about this. All I know is that uh, it has Book Snake on it, so that's cool. Glad to see. We love to see her on another cover, and I also know that Yale is involved. But that's all I know. And I also this has trigger warnings for um, rape. I think I don't know for sure, but I think it has that trigger warning so yeah but i am very excited to read ninth house and hopefully this book will uh reignite my love for lee bardugo i'm really really hoping all right roll numero dos a six we have never oh we have gotten a six so this is our second six all right one, two, three, four, five, six. Woo! Woo! All right. So let's try out this dice counter again. One, two, three, four, five, six. Family movie night. Gran and I buddy read. Ooh! I added this because I thought it'd be, you know, a good card to add because my grand and I buddy read a ton of books each month. So. Okay, that's another perfectly okay, fine prompt. I am scared. Because now I have to pick if I want to go this route and have a chance of having to add two to one more book on my TBR. Or if I just want to go the safe route. I do not know what I want to pick. So for the second prompt, I got Granny and I buddy read, and I don't know what my Granny and I are going to be reading in December. Unlike November, we had Hollow Pox, and what well, Hollow Pox came out at the end of October, but we had Hollow Pox, and we had a loft coming out. So we had like a plan to follow through in November, but I don't really know what we're going to be getting to in December. So I'm just going to put the fourth book in the Percy Jackson series. Um, I do think that we'll get to this by, de like, in December, uh, but I don't know for sure, so this is kind of like an iffy one, because I just, I don't know what my granny is going to read. If she can get this from the library, then we will be reading it, but if she can't get it from the library, then we will not be reading it. Um, I personally have loved the, I loved the first, uh, Percy Jackson. The second Percy Jackson was okay and we are currently reading the third book so i'm very excited for this especially because the fourth and fifth book are not formulaic like the first three so yes i'm very excited for this one i hope it's good i hope it's amazing um so yeah okay i'm gonna roll the die and i'm gonna if i get a number below six then i'll go the family route if i get a number above six i will go the safe route okay I got a six. Wait, a number below six. What am I going to do about six? Okay, we'll roll it again. Okay. I got a... No! Oh, dang it! Okay, I'm going the family route. All right, here we go. Roll number three. Oops. Okay, well, that's a one and a four. Oh, my God. 
One, two, three, four. <gasps> Our first fun one! Yay! Okay, so... Okay, yeah, that was a five, not a four, but oh, we're going to go with it, all right? I know, I, I, I know, I was supposed to go five spaces, I only went four, but I don't know, I don't know how that happened, but I went four, so. So, if you don't know, when you land on a house, you read your most recent purchase, or you can use it as buying a new book, but I'm not going to do that, I'm just going to read one of my most recent purchases, so... That is perfectly fine. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, and then for the third and final roll, we got a fun card, which is house. So yes, we have finally landed on a house, which means that we get to read our most recent purchase, or we could buy a new book to read for that month. But I'm going to read my most recent purchase, and because my most recent purchases were uh, birthday related, I had a little bit of a choice, but I thought I'd be reasonable and so I picked Maya and the Rising Dark by Renna Barron. So this is a middle grade by Renna Barron and I loved her debut novel Kingdom of Souls. And this is actually a book that was on my 2020 anticipated so I thought this would be a great pick because it made the most sense. Like I own it. I wanted to read it last year at this time so it only makes sense that now that I own it I should read it. I don't have an excuse. So yes, I don't know what this is about really. All I know is it's a middle grade and that it uh, is by Renna and I loved Renna's first book so I'm very excited for this one. Alright everybody, that is going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I am literally dying right now. Uh, the I don't know how Troy does it. These are really annoying me and I don't even have them all wrapped around me. I only have three strands so, or one strand wrapped three times. I don't have three strands around. Okay, <laughs> calm down. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big fat thumbs up and subscribe down below because I post videos on this channel every single Monday and when December comes in, it is end of the year wrap up, like end of the year wrap ups, end of the year, like, favorite books, most disappointing books, all those things. So yes, guys, get ready. It is coming. December is here. So I hope you guys are excited for December's videos. I always look forward to doing them, so I am super excited for them. So yes, um, like I said, I'm going to go like, subscribe, do all those fun things. If you have any videos you would like to see on my channel, please comment them down below. And I hope you guys are excited for my reading vlogs coming next year. I have one that is like a fun, like, blank does blank for my blank books so that's not the title but yeah leaves you in suspense and i'm also going to be doing the most popular book of 2020 which i have to buy because i can't get it from the library for six months and by then that would be way too late help me okay i'm gonna go love y'all so very much and um yeah don't forget i'm still a freaking bulldozer bye everybody